Hey guys, this is Adam with Thoroughbred Diesel. Uh, today we're going to be doing an unboxing video on an SMB cold air intake. This is going to be part number 75-5045. This is going to be for a 6.5 liter uh, Chevy engine. So I'm just going to uh, point out some features on the box. Uh, I do have the SMB logo. You'll have that on all three other sides. Uh, the only really distinguishing feature is the uh, tag down here with the part number will draw attention to that. It can also be located in this upper corner as well. So I'm just going to set this box to the side, start pulling parts out and telling you about them. So first thing we're going to reach in here and pull out is the uh, outlet tube on this engine. Uh, this is actually going to bolt right up to the um, the air intake box, you can see where the mounting hardware goes in right there and the lip that allows it to sit on the box. Uh, the filter actually bolt, I'm sorry, clamps up to this portion of the outlet tube right there. Uh, and you can see it also has a place here for um, your CVT elbow. So I'm just going to set that to the side. And the next thing we'll bring up is actually going to be the box itself. And you can see it has the recessed edge right here where the SMB uh, clear plexiglass lid will sit. Um, you also have the back portion right here, which you'll see is also recessed. That is where this lid, actually, I'm sorry, the outlet tube actually joins. If I can get it to sit in correctly, I'll demonstrate that. And obviously you put your bolts in right there. So I'm just going to sit that to the side. Uh, you'll see the air induction side where it actually draws the air in. You also have that same uh, option on this end. Uh, we'll show you one other feature about this box. Um, actually comes with what they call a box plug or a box cap. Um, what this allows you to do is this side will draw in more heat. It will draw in a lot more air if you leave this side open, but it is going to draw in more heat. So those of you that are very conscious about how much heat you're drawing in, uh, SMB does include this box plug. It just snaps right in there like that, as you can see, and closes that side off as well. So, so we'll just set that to the side over here. And the next thing we'll pull out is going to be uh, the actual filter itself. Um, before I unbox it all the way, I will point out that there is a part number right here that you uh, should make sure and take note of. This is going to be the actual fil filter part number itself. Uh, if for some reason if you do need to replace your filter, having this part number readily accessible will make it a lot easier for you to get uh, the correct filter. So I'm going to take our filter out, set the box to the side over here. Uh, you can see the clamp is already on the filter, ready to go. Uh, based on the purple color, you should be able to tell that this is SMB's cotton uh, oiled intake. Um, we will make a note that there is a dry version of this kit available as well. Uh, all of the components in this kit are the same whether you have the dry or the oiled version, the altitude, the box, everything. The only difference in the two kits is the media of the filter. So instead of having this nice purple color, you'll have the white dry media instead. So we'll go ahead and set the filter to the side. And we'll pull out the silicone coupler right there. And then we'll dive right into the hardware packs. And the first thing we'll pull out is the hose, uh, the CBT elbow hose, which connects right here. And you can see how that goes on. And first hardware we're going to pull out is the two clamps for the silicone coupler. Uh, this hardware pack is for the plexiglass lid. You'll see that it has some rubber and metal washers and some bolts. Holds the plexiglass lid onto the uh, top of the air intake box. And the last hardware pack, which includes the remainder of the mounting hardware, and it also includes the clamps for the CVT hose over here. So we'll get the last pack out of the box now. And 
And the first thing that we'll pull out of the box is going to be the instruction sheet. Uh, you'll notice that SMB does have full color step-by-step uh, -step instructions. Uh, makes it very nice for installation, a whole lot easier with having color because you can see each individual component in the engine. So we'll flip over to the back of this. It's probably the second most important thing on the sheet. Uh, you get a full inventory list of all the pieces and parts that should be included in this kit, as well as an exploded map view telling you where each part should go. I'll lay those over there. And the next thing we're going to get out is the clear plexiglass lid. Uh, obviously, this is brown in this video uh, because it still has the protective paper over top of it. But you can see that the SMB logo has already been etched into the top of the uh, plexiglass lid. And the last thing that comes in your kit is going to be your SMB decal. So that concludes the unboxing video of um, this cold air intake. Part number again was 75-5045. Again, this is for a 6.5 liter engine. Um, if you have any questions, make sure and post them in the comments below. Uh, feel free to call us or email us as well. Make sure and subscribe to our YouTube channel for more videos like this and like us on Facebook. So thanks for watching, guys.